she is speaking or encouraging a young publisher? Hi, Macy. I know it's been a while since we last sat down to talk, but I've been meaning to ask you how you enjoyed our last district convention at Long Beach. Hi, Marilyn. I had fun at the convention. My mom packed us some yummy lunch, and I got to meet a lot of new friends. <coughs> a lot of new friends. <laughs> what, was, what else do you remember about that day? Um, do you know how many people attended on the last day? How many? It was almost 10,000 people. Is that a lot of people? Wow, 10,000 people. That is a lot of people, huh? Mace, and isn't it how, isn't it amazing how despite how all those people were there, everything was so well organized? Um, the parking, the seats, even the baptism and all the talks, they went according to the program and everything was just so orderly. Mace, do you know how this is possible, being so well organized? Yes, it's because we're Jehovah's Witnesses. Yes, that's exactly what, um, why it is. It's because we worship <coughs> Jehovah and we represent Him. You know, Macy, the Bible describes Jehovah as a God of order. He is the best organizer there is. And I know we can't see them physically, but Jehovah also has an angel amongst the angels. Jehovah also has an organization amongst the angels, too. Do you want to read about it? Sure. Okay, let's open our Bible and turn to the book of Daniel. It's in chapter 7, verses 9 and 10. So Daniel 7, 9 and 10. And if you're there, I can read this for us. It says here that I kept on beholding until there were thrones placed, and the Ancient of Days sat down. His clothing was white just like snow, and the hair of his head was like clean wool. His throne was flames of fire, its wheel were a burning fire. There was the stream of fire flowing and going out from before him. There were a thousand thousands that kept ministering to him, and ten thousand times ten thousand that kept standing right before him. The court took its seat, and there were books that were open. So this is a vision that Daniel had, and he sees all these angels that were sitting around the Ancient of Days. Mace, can you guess who this Ancient of Days might be? Um, Jehovah. Very good. <clears throat> um, you know how it said there was thousands thousands that kept ministering to him, and 10,000 times 10,000 that was sitting before him? That sounds like a lot of angels, huh? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Daniel says that all those angels, they were ministering to Jehovah and standing before him. Mace, what do you think this means? I don't know that they were talking to Jehovah in front of him. Very good. Mace, <coughs> in fact, let's read another scripture together that kind of oh. describes what you um, said, and it describes what the angels are doing now and what they were doing in the past. It's in the book of Psalms 103, verses 20 and 21. Do you want to read that for us? Okay. Psalms 103, verses 20 and 21. It says, Bless Jehovah, all you angels of his mighty and powers carrying on his work by listening to the voice of his word. Bless Jehovah, all your armies of his, the ministers of his, doing his will. Very good. That was very good reading, Mace. As we just read, um, these angels are like an army who listens to what Jehovah tells them to do, and they do exactly so. So imagine all those angels that has to stand before Jehovah and listen to what he has to tell them. Do you think that all those thousands and thousands of angels have to act in a very orderly and an organized way? Well, if they weren't organized, they wouldn't know what to do. Exactly. And I'm sure that you've experienced that maybe in, in school during um, your class, when the kids are being really loud and they're not really paying attention, it's very hard to hear what the teacher is saying and follow direction. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, as we um, kind of talked about today, we see that we worship Jehovah, God, um, a God of order. And even though we can't see Jehovah, we see how well organized he is, for example, as we saw in the district convention. And as we just discussed, we can be sure that Jehovah's angels organize as well. Well, I see that your mom made us some goodies, so let's go have some. Really?